Yo, what is going on guys? My mom's coming back at it again with another hype video. On this channel, numerous times before, I've preached the importance of playing intense outdoor sp uh, team sport preferably, like basketball or soccer. Something that involves heaps of intense running, jumping, stuff like that. But it is understandable that some of you guys may not have the accessibility to those facilities. For example, an outdoor basketball court or even a soccer pitch. So, in this video today, I'm going to showcase you guys a really easy at-home exercise routine that you can do that's also going to achieve similar results to um, those outdoor intense sports that I talk about. For those of you who are new to the channel, my name is Jack. I am 6 foot 2 and my parents are pretty short at 5 foot 4 and 5 foot 6 respectively. And I share my experiences on here on how I was able to grow taller even though my genetics are not the most gifted. So yeah, if you like what I talk about on here, consider subscribing to the channel, hitting, hitting the like button, commenting below what you want to see next. And without further blabbing around, let's get straight into today's video. Okay, now first things first, I would like for you guys to do a warm up, proper warm up before you start any of the exercises. So yeah, this is usually the warm up I like to do. So yeah, pretty much do a bit of marching around, lifting your legs off the floor, doing a bit of shoulder stretches, wrist, ankle stretches, get every single joint of your body warmed up so you're ready for the exercise. And now that warm ups out of the way, we can get into the good stuff, which is the exercise component. I'm going to do the exercise component outside and I'm going to briefly explain it, what it's going to mainly compose of to you guys. Like I mentioned before in my exercise video, the most important factors for your bones to grow longer is tension on the bones, as well as uh, hormone secretion. So this short routine is going to focus on those two components. We're going to focus on placing heaps of tension on our long bones in the lower limb, which has the most you know, potential to grow a lot. And we're also going to complete some strength training Wait, baby! just a little bit of strength training on the right muscles to make sure we're getting taller and that the growth hormone in our body is secreting so component number one is just going to going to be a jump circuit where i'm going to have you guys completing a range of different jumps and the first one we're going to do are just some stationary pogo hops so yeah, nothing too complicated, find a hard surface and complete some near max effort jumps continuously. I think that was around 20. Next, we have rope skipping. I don't have a, really have a, have a rope here, so we're just gonna have to pretend like I have one. Now, hopefully that's around 30 seconds. I don't think it is, but yes, 30 seconds of those. Finally, we have just finding a higher place that you can jump off of and then landing on your feet. So I'm gonna demonstrate here. Well, I just have a little chair, which is not as high as I would like it to be. Ideally, you wanna find something that's around 70 centimeters or 80 centimeters. Um, so yeah, that way that's really gonna place a lot of stress on your shin bone. And yeah, uh, for time's sake, I'm not gonna do 15 of those, but I would recommend 15 of those in a, in a set. And those are the three exercises. I want you guys to do all three of them together and then have a rest and then do all three of them together again, have a rest and then do all three of them together again, have a rest. Three sets. Okay, uh, looks like we're back inside. So let's move on to the uh, strength training component. With this exercise, you want to find something heavy. Uh, for myself, I've got a backpack stuffed full of books. You just want to uh, do some kind of like uh, Romanian deadlifts, but for your lower back. I'll demonstrate. And that's really going to activate your lower back muscles and strengthen it up to um, help, your, help your posture and it's also gonna facilitate some upper body growth as well. And also, with the same backpack, you're more than welcome to do some arm exercises as well. For example, like a lateral raise, or you can do some 
bicep curls and stuff like that, um, just to boost your human growth hormone production. And finally, we have some stretches. First, we have the standing, reach for the toes, stretch. Then we have the kind of pull your leg behind your back stretch, like I'm doing right there. And yeah, that's gonna loosen up the two most prominent lower limb muscles of your quads and your hamstrings. Please do keep in mind, the most important aspect of the strength, uh, of this growing taller exercise program is the jumping outside aspect. The other aspects are just the icing on the cake. And that's why I didn't go too much, too much into detail with those because I don't want to take up too much of you guys, your guys' time. So yeah, for those, you can pretty much do um, what you feel comfortable and what you like doing. For example, you really like doing the bicep curls. You can just focus more on the bicep curls. And yeah, that's about a 15 minute program, I will say. Um, you can do that on a daily basis. And if you do exercise outside of this program, then I would probably suggest um, taking a rest day here or there to make sure your body recovers. And yeah, any questions, leave them down in the comment section below. With that being said, it's gonna bring us to the end of another Mau Mouse video. Hope you guys enjoyed this program. Um, let me know how you guys go. Let me know if any of you guys noticed some good results and let me know if you've done something different and that's helped you um, with growing taller as well. So yeah, I'll see you all next week. Peace.